Solenoid operated ballast water trucks. There's two conventional methods. One is a Namua mounted unit so that the actual solenoid can mount directly onto the actuator like that uh, by this back panels there and a couple of O-rings. This mounts directly. In this, that particular case the solenoid is, is exposed to the water and air um, and dirt. The other method which we recommend is to have the unit manifolded so that the valves are presented on a manifold like this and put into a cabinet, separate place on the, on the truck and it allow us to allow you to have um, control over your unit and keep out the dirt and dust. Piped up a, a sort of demonstration unit here. Uh, the actual units themselves can come when you order them, you can either order them as a complete assembly from us or individually. There's a, an example of a manifold. Comes with the gaskets and the screws and the actual unit mounts directly onto there like that. So you can, you can manifold these together. You can have two station, four, six, eight, ten, twelve and also multiples in between. It's a very economical and simple way of doing it. Uh, the units themselves have manual overrides, a little push button and push button to lock override and they also come with LED connectors on the actual valves and so that they can when the power's on it'll, the LED light will come on. I'll demonstrate the units themselves on this system. Wired up a simple little panel here which you can purchase from any um, electrical place and on this has got the little units operates so all we do is just put the power onto here and the actual valve itself over here operates now that's a pretty quick action you can run these quite some distance it's only a small air supply on here and they operate almost instantaneously there's an indicator on top of the valve to show the open and closed position. Open, closed. And the other one above it. And also we can do the same thing with ball valves. And you can have multiple sets of valves on your truck. One, two, three, four, five, six. Doesn't make a difference. We can supply them individually like that or any combination. As I said before, the actual unit, when you put the power onto it, lights up, the LED lights up inside here. And also by pressing down the manual override, you can make the unit operate. We can put recommend filters that go into the end here, the silencers. The inlet supply goes through the center two exhaust ports and that supply feeds all the valves and then the outlets two cylinder ports are on the top a simple but effective way of doing water trucks we can supply all the, the tubing and fittings all the ancillary equipment outside of the electrics and we have the whole kit that can be supplied right through from the butterfly valves ball valves, actuators, fittings, tubing, solenoids. It's a complete assembly.